See, as soon as Harry level changes and puts his hands down on his knees, George is hitting the split. That was nice. So the critical thing about the wall, in the sense that it changes takedown defense, specifically double leg defense, is it removes the possibility of the sprawl. That's really the critical difference. So the strategy that we're adopting is using the split. Okay, so what we used to do back in the day, you know, just grab a hold of a double, run the guy into the fence, and put him down. And it worked really, really great, right up until it didn't. Guys started to figure out how to split, how to adjust their stance, and create a new style of takedown defense. So now we need to be a little bit more, a little bit wiser than just grabbing the double straight up. So let's see what happens when George tries to get in on double on Harry, just without, without any real setup. Okay, he's straight away, he's gone with the split. George is committed there. Okay, so now here, what's gonna go wrong? Harry, I want you to put a weak underhook. I want you to try to underhook the shoulder. It's very, very tempting to underhook the shoulder because that's what we were doing before when we are pummeling in the over-under. So Harry's got that underhook here, but look what happens when he tries to lift it up. He's spent a lot of arm energy here. His arm's in a mechanically weak position, and George is gonna be able to beat that. Lower your level, please, George. Look what happens there. He's crushed it. Okay, and now here he's gonna be able to link his hands and get out of there. So the critical thing that we need to do is prevent the guy from linking his hands. Once that guy gets his hands linked, good chance that you're going for a ride. Okay, so let's see it again here. Harry split, get your base nice and broad. Here, yeah, and that foot's wedged in here. George, can you pick the angle? So this is a big mistake. Guys, oftentimes, they go for an angle pick from here, you know, and it's not there, it, it's not on. The balance isn't right. Okay, go grab that angle. Now there, he's just giving it away. Harry can pick that up with wrist control, get underneath it. Yeah. So that's a mistake. If you're gonna if you're gonna make an angle pick from there, we're gonna have to do something a little bit more sophisticated. But right now, get back on that double for me, please. Okay, nice broad split, wedging that foot in to defend the angle pick. Okay, now here, yeah, this is where Harry's on the hook's got to go. Get that dug in here. That's it there. So he's attacking the elbow. Draw that right up from here so that elbow's getting high. Now reverse your split. So that's what's gonna help elevate the on the hook. That's where the power is gonna come from. Okay, George, don't be quite so loose for me this time, please. You'll go back in there. So you're not fighting 100%, but just give him a, a little bit of a reasonable grab. Okay, now here, Harry, you're gonna have to recruit your hips. So that, that's what happens when you reverse the split. So get lower, turn underneath. You see how Harry gets higher as he changes the split? And there, George's end up on the fence. And look what's happened with his stance. His stance is messed up. George is gonna have to do some work to get into his split from here. And in that time, Harry can get in and make an easy tackle. Okay, so let's see it again. Okay, that was a good one. Okay, so it looks really messy and grindy, this style of fighting. You see what's really going on here? I actually want you to show it, so I don't get embarrassed. Okay, there's like an elegant bit of kung fu, you know, something like some Tai Chi. Okay, get in your split position, that's it. And nice, yeah, okay, without a partner. And nice and slowly here, I just want you to just raise your level as you come up and rotate. That's it. Not said elegant. Make it look beautiful. I can't do that. <laughs> come on, let's see it again. Okay, you see that? As Harry gets his hip underneath his elbow here and turns the split, that's what raises his level. But he's raising his level with the man attached and that's what's gonna reverse him. So the power here is not coming from the arm at all, the power's coming from the hip. Okay, let's see it live one more time. And on the double, hits the split, that's it. Bumps that hip up, reverses the split, and gets off. So you guys are only just to start up in the resistance now. Okay, start working for that double a little bit. Yeah, there you go, get in there, Harry. You're already in. Okay. Just each time, just give him a little extra 5%. That's it. Okay, good job. You get on your double now. Go straight for that double. That's it. Harry's hitting the split and reversing the split. There you go. See, as soon as Harry level changes and puts his hands down on his knees, George is hitting the split. That was nice. That's it. Get those hips lower. Yeah, that's it. Broad split. That's it. This time I really want you to try to score. Really fight that on the hoop. Good job. Take a break. Take a breather.